everybody. It's Linda G. And today we have Arthur sort of taking the place of Mel for Mel Mondays. I'm the cheap substitute. You're, you're the, and he was way cheaper than Mel, too. Yeah. Did you Hamburger. get those box of cookies yet? No, but I got, but you gave I got the you know the coupon for Black Angus, but Black Angus isn't around anymore. Oh, it was one of my favorites. <laughs> yeah, there's one in San Lorenzo, I think. I'm, I'm just teasing. You. I remember one time I was calling four one one looking for their number, wanted to make reservations. I accidentally said the Black Anus. And the operator busted out laughing because that's our usual. We usually called it the black anus, but the food back then was good. Yeah. I don't know if it's good anymore. I don't know either. I have a hard time with beef now. I can't do can't do beef like I used to do. Aw. So listen, um, everybody's talking about, and I told people on one of my videos, I did not feel a sexual relationship between the diaper Don and uh, Loomer. No. I just like- I think they, they, she's touchy. She brings him up. She acts like he's very good looking, but I, I'm not seeing it. I, I get her stuck in the flames, like just the like partners in crime. Yeah. Like bringing up the Hannibal Lecter stuff. Bring up, bring them at the eating of the animals. Come on, you can do it. You know, that kind of cheerleader type crap she, she's so evil she fascinates him evil is attracted to evil right so i guess we could say she's like ava braun right now there was a but no ava wasn't out there like loomer is yeah and ava didn't get those eyebrows like her but anyway uh she, she apparently people are saying she was blocked out of uh air force one that's not true in fact, yesterday when they attempted suicide attempt, which we'll talk about. Assassination. Suicide. Uh, assassination. Mm -hmm. uh, she said, I'm on my way. I packed my things. I'm going to go make sure he's okay. They wouldn't block her up. They wouldn't. Listen, he gave her the info on Lindsay where she made that announcement. I understand you like men. I like men too. Oh, it's, there's nothing wrong with that. I like men too. It's like, whoa. Yeah. yeah. But she, well, it's because he basically he, said that the the debate was he uh, he was horrible in that debate, and so this is his retribution. Right, but also, can I tell you, a lot of people don't like her, and I will tell you that that rumor that she was was started by an insider could have even been Marjorie Taylor Greene. Oh, I would be surprised. She's she she's jealous of her number one. Very jealous. She even slapped her hand for for downgrading. Uh, what what was it a religion or what was she downgrading? Oh, I forget. Anyway, she made some sort of comment that Taylor Green wouldn't have any problem with if it was anybody else. And she scolded her. Ain't that just precious? So they're asking is will Trump confirm or deny he, he and Loomer are an item? He appreciates her all over him like a cheap suit, but no. She's not his type, I'll be honest with you. No, I mean, yeah, she's going to baby him, change his diaper. You know? Yeah, she's outspoken. She's tough. Kind of like, but she was more real, our girl, but it wasn't a sexual thing. I don't think he can perform, I'll be honest. That's between you and me but uh, and the people listening. But I, I it's kind of like, uh, it's kind of like the, uh, the, uh, the, Woman he paid 130000 to. What's her name? Stormy Daniels. Kind of like Stormy. You know, Stormy was very head on. She said what she felt. He likes that. Yeah. He likes that. It speaks her mind. Well, it's kind of like a guy almost, not some, you know. Yeah, but he likes to be spanked. Spent towel. Yeah. He likes to be spanked. But only his. Oh, there it is. If oh. only his. Um, if only his. It's a magazine with him in it. Yeah, <laughs> but he. But anyway, it. I just don't feel it. I could be wrong, you guys. I don't. You guys know don't what? really let me go into the underhandedness or the deep dive of any kind of thing like that. Well, kind of when I asked my guides about, it, they just said, "Do you want to throw up?" Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> I had to get. You know, it was like, do I get a vomit distress bag now or? 
Yeah. Because some of the stuff they show us, it's like, I can't tell people this. No, that my, my stuff isn't ugly like that. My stuff is Armageddon stuff, which is like, we got to be careful with this earth and we need to take care of it now. Oh, yeah. But um, I even told my client this morning, she lives in New Jersey. Uh, but right now she's in Philly helping take care of her mom. And she rents, she's a lawyer and she rents in a, a place because and she goes back and forth to New York. And I said, you know what? Stay renting right now. I want everybody to stay rented. Be get rid of all your clutter and be able. Not everybody's going to get affected like some people are, but be able to move on a dime if you need to. Well, that's like the American Indians always question. Oh, we always were in motion. We couldn't understand the white man's fantasy with owning property. Owning, nobody can own the earth. No. Mother Nature will say, "Oh, really? Kick your ass right out." Yeah, Mother so, Nature will still be here. We'll be gone. Let's talk about this guy with this attempted assassination. Apparently, he didn't get a bullet out. It was the the Secret Service, the Service saw him, and they started shooting. And um, first thing he did was go to his webpage and start trying to collect money. Oh, yeah. The grift is on. The grift is on. Yeah. That's what I'm, the, the solo show I'm working on. That's going to be the title. Yeah. <laughs> the grift but goes on. This guy's a whack job for sure. Oh, yeah. And he, he but he's, to, not, a, he's and, not a Haitian and he's not a trans and. No. Uh, he's not a Democrat. No, but he's still blaming Biden for everything. Yeah. But the, I haven't heard the news. I'm, of course, you know, something like this happens. And at every breath you take, every channel is showing it. But yeah, but it's, it's also, it, but on this case, I really think the news got ahead of itself on this one because of the, what happened in Butler, that they wanted to get right on top of it. And because and, there, was, there was some other stuff coming out that didn't make any sense until finally they had the, um, First, I heard it was a young guy. Then I heard it was an older man. I also heard there were it, there were two people shooting at each other outside. Yeah, there was a gunfight. Yeah, it was a gunfight. Thank God that guy saw saw the gun outside the bushes because you don't want Trump to be a set. You do not want that. No, I want him to bars. go up to November first and be beaten with a magazine. Yeah, he might like that too much. Yeah, you probably would. Okay, so anyway. or the Time magazine with Kamala Harris on it. Kamala Harris. Did it another one? No, remember the one picture that the the drawing of Kamala Harris, and you said, "Oh, it looks like Melania. It's so beautiful." I'm like, "Yeah, hit him with that." Yeah, ah. there you go. There you go. <laughs> but I feel this guy will be put somewhat put away but they i do see them stamp him with uh 5150 or a psycho even though he didn't actually shoot the gun he he, his, he had it with him so his intent like, will be yeah. there um it's not like hinkley who actually took a shot yeah so he's uh the guides just told me he's definitely in trouble hmm. uh but is there more let's ask is there more I mean more lunatics? More attempts. I just heard no. Um, it's true, Kamala and Biden and and have better um security. Yeah. But you know, this man's supposed to be a billionaire. Let him add more security. Let him pay for it. Yeah. If you're saying, you know, he really doesn't have the same amount as Biden. Well, he's not president. Huh. Get you some more people and you take you pay for it. Why would the taxpayers have to pay for it? And you know, Biden is not listen, letting him listen into the intel. He oh. has because he's the right one, he has he has the he even said on a show, yeah, they're not letting me live because they're afraid it'll leak. So it's probably better because if something leaks, they can't blame me. On one of my last shows, I had that question. 
should we worry about him getting this stuff? I said, well, this is what my guides are showing me. And it was a page fully redacted from beginning to end, just black. That's, that's what he yeah. got. There's but remember, he cut out uh, Biden, too. Biden yeah. had a right to a lot of things. They didn't even help him transition till the very end. No. no. But I mean, I guess they got tired of writing his, you know, his uh, everything in Crayola. So. Oh, we have so much good news coming in, you guys. I can't begin to tell you. Uh, If I'm here every day, just to remind you that we are sitting in the nine of cups. The world is, is, is together. We're almost like children. Uh, He's suffering with lack of money. His cycle will change, by the way. He's lacking with money. Mm -hmm. Um, And he's trying to bring back the good old days. And the good old days for him was when he he won. He was so shocked he won. They said he was walking around. You know, I remember in the inaugural lunch, making Hillary and Bill Clinton stand up and to just throw smoke up their rear. What wonderful people they are and all that. And the next day he's saying, lock her up. Yeah. Well, it's whatever the script says for the next day, for the next show. That, that's how he approaches everything. And yeah. sound bites. It's just nice. Uh, but I do have to say, I keep on getting these questions. What? Um, do you still see, like, here, do you still see Harris winning? All the spin about her not moving up in the polls is driving me nuts. It's like, number one, don't look at polls? the polls. Yeah, number one, don't look at the polls. And there was a poll today that she was six points ahead now. Yeah. She's but, ahead, but, only but, one point ahead in Nevada. But even though she, she may say she's six points ahead, we have to look at it. She's six points behind. We still have to be diligent yes. about this and keep moving but forward. I don't know. And I, I feel guilty by just overemphasizing the fact she's going to win. I don't want, like you said, people to get comfortable. Like with Hillary. But uh, yeah, everybody thought it's a done deal. She was, what, 40% up or something? Mm-hmm. Everybody thought, yeah, she'll win. And she didn't get the, the, especially the youth didn't come out for her. And then when Pennsylvania, she lost Pennsylvania, that was it. Oh, Kamala's going to get North Carolina. Oh, yeah. And Pennsylvania. That. Yeah. And I don't know, she may get Florida, you guys, but I just still don't feel Texas. I know they're saying it's it's a tie, but. I you know, know I just feel ballots are going to be hidden in Texas. I'm sorry. I feel yeah. I feel there's some skullduggery going on. Well, yeah. the AG announced that he hid 2,500 ballots from with the Vegas. last election. Yeah. yeah. No, it's, it's still. I still feel a sense of relief knowing that she's going to win from what my guides keep on showing me and what your guys, are sh- what we keep all of us keep on seeing. It's just a matter of, but we have to make it happen. We can't yeah. just sit around and help somebody else does it. We yeah. all have to be involved. Now, the October surprise. What is the October surprise to you? That he's still alive. <laughs> <laughs> he, he, he said that perfectly straight eyed yeah, that he's still alive. <laughs> what is the October surprise? I don't know where that comes from. Do you? Is that there's always there's always or? something like that every year? Somebody says something comes up, you know. I know people have said, oh, in the month of such and such, this and this, and then nothing happens. It's the same thing, different day. I think it was like with Hillary, the, her October surprise, you know, right before the election. But the servers and everything. Yeah, but remember that was, uh, uh, was um, that, who was in charge? No, that was Obama's team in charge. No, but that, but that was, uh, what's his name? The, Comey. Comey, yeah. But um, you don't play that that whole thing. But I and it didn't help that it, her assistant yes. had all those emails in his computer. Yeah. Plus an email of him with a big heart on. But then again, the Russians had all his. They invaded everything from the DNC, but they also did the same with the RNC. But they never released anything from the RNC. Yeah. Yeah. I just feel the October surprises that. There's stuff that's going to be coming out with Jack Smith in the New York case. I mean, in the uh, D.C. case with Chuck in and people are going to see he did what? Yeah. And I also think we might even it won't happen now, but we might even reset the uh, 
the the Florida thing. It will, it will be a surprise. It's the ending of something. The a doubt. battle ensuing um, struggle. Ooh, somebody may die. That's a coffin. Gosh, I hope it's not Trump. Please, God, don't let it be Trump. I want him to see what he did. I wonder if it's like President Carter and people will be upset. The other thing, while we were talking, I heard whisper in my ear. Also, this has something to do with Putin. I've always felt that he's going to be assassinated by the end of the year, entertainment purposes only. Yeah. So. Oh, and Netanyahu both are going to go out about the same time. You know, you had talked about a, a dream or a vision you had with a, a black hood over Netanyahu? Yes. Someone was taking, well, it wasn't black. It was cloth on his face, like okay. he was being kidnapped and put in a car, and they covered his face with a cloth. Okay. Because I, after you said that, I kept on feeling like, yeah, I could see a black cloth going and then carting him away. And if they're doing that, he's not escaping. Someone's taking him. Right. So it could even be his own military. Because yeah. once they take him out, they can just hand him over to for uh, his trials for uh, what is he? They want him for hurting humans. What what's the name of it? It's called uh, crimes against humanity. Uh, yeah, he's they they're waiting for him so they can arrest him and put him in jail. Mm -hmm. So okay, so and we get I get a feeling that Putin's involved. I get a feeling it's a death of someone major. It might even be Jimmy Carter. You know, I will say this, though. I hope that Jimmy Carter, I feel he may be able to do a, sign, a, a mail in ballot or whatever. Yeah, ago. but I do feel he'll go before November 5th. Yeah, but I do feel I he'll got go that hit a while ago. Mm -hmm. And don't forget, Betty White had a big party plan for her 100. Yeah. She couldn't wait. She woke up and just passed away. Yeah. Oops. And she was more active than Jimmy is. Yeah. Because Jimmy's even in that phase where he's got a little bit of gate. Yeah. You know. But. So, uh, it, and it's news of the world, you guys. It will, the perspective. I don't know. This Jimmy Carter passing wouldn't affect the world as much as this is going to. This is more about. And it doesn't feel like it's about Trump. I feel it's something. I even feel about something about Putin and some underhanded stuff is going to be coming out. Yeah. Uh, the whole thing with the. Uh, you know, like, remember the old movie, The Russians Are Coming? The Russians Are Coming? I love that movie. I <laughs> own it, by the way. Oh. I have a couple, another extra. Would you like one? A DVD. Sure. sure. Uh, that was with Carl Reiner and... Everybody must get Hamilton. off ship. Yeah, Margaret Hamilton, I think, was in that, too. Who? But Margaret Hamilton, Wicked Witch of the West. The actress. Oh, was she? She probably was. They they yeah. operator. You remember she was a little bit chubby, and they mm -hmm. they, uh, they they tied up her and Paul Reiner face to face yeah. like this. It was so funny. But what I'm saying is the fact that the Russians are coming. I really feel all this stuff with the influencers, with people in the House, possible Senate. This is stuff is going to start coming out. Yeah, and, and it's not paid. the tower, so it's not like an episode. Of an event happening, although we're having big events, it's not like some catastrophe. Catastrophe. Yeah, I don't feel that. Or a, a bomb or something. It's no. more like news of this. Well, I keep on feeling like, holy, <laughs> give it what? So that, you know, we manifest, us humans, we're so good at manifesting. That's why we have to be careful not to jump the gun. We'll Always a negative. Though, bad news. Me. Or, oh, you know, I hear Kamala's, a, you know, get off that boat. Just focus. Say, yes, she's going to win. She's going to win. No, she has won. Yeah. And then what will happen is we manifest. So mm -hmm. if we're worried about an October surprise, we might make it happen. Yeah. Well, I I don't know what the October surprise is. Like I said, he's still alive. That's my surprise. <laughs> I don't want him to go until after the election. 
But, you know, who am I? I didn't want Ruth Gator Ginsburg. None of us did. But she-, she told us she was going in the new year. So we thought it was the new year coming out, but it was the Jewish new year. Yeah, exactly. But-, but it was all supposed to happen. And by the way, what are you getting on um, on top on uh, Justice Roberts? He made a decision to help Trump before it was even asked. Did you see that? I did. He was going to use um, what's his name to write up the thing, but then that flag thing happened. Oh, Alito. And then he told everybody they had to be concurrent with this. They all had, and they, you know, the the three refused. Mm -hmm. But can you imagine? He's supposed to be fair. And he turned around and did this. Can I just look at him real quick? Sure, please. What are you getting on him? What I've always gotten on him was. I've said this before. Remember when John Boehner was just losing control with the Republicans and he said, I'm out of here. I'm done. That's what I keep on feeling around. Roberts is like, I can't do this anymore. Yeah, but he also feels like he's part of the problem. Unlike Boehner. Well, Boehner was a little bit of an idiot. But Roberts, I feel it went through his head a little bit that he's above it. Yeah, yeah. You know. But he wanted to protect Trump, which Trump is a terrible person. Unless Trump has something on him, that's all I can think. Well, but- also, again, and it could be Russia, but also they really wanted that abortion thing. The what thing? The abortion. They wanted oh, yeah. to oh, yeah. present it to them. So even before the case was before them, he was already coming up. You know, he's upset that got leaked out. Good. And probably Lita probably leaked it. So tell me about, I got it. The best way to pick up is if you're on neutral, like a hum. Yeah. You can't think of anything. You can't push looking. Just allow it to come to you. And his wife is underhanded. She made a bunch of money. Yep. Oh, she made a bunch of money. More money stuff's going to come out about him. More money, more money, more money. I I, I do get that uh, what I had seen before. I see him having to walk away. I see him saying, I've done I've done all I can do. And don't forget when Jack gets in there, when Kamala wins and Jack gets in there, he everybody knows, like Jenny Thomas and everybody knows, TikTok. And I, I think see. he's looking at her wife. I think he's looking at uh, Robert's wife. Robert's wife. Yeah, because she's working at that law firm that was bringing lawyers and. Yeah, it's, yeah, they're gonna. They want to sap. This is the thing that's really going to be the kicker. Remember, I said this. I saw the Senate and pulling in all the justices, mm-hmm. and uh, but maybe not the three that work by the constitution but saying wait a second when we interviewed you you said you were going to do this this and this you we have it under oath so you're lying to us i see when that starts up he's going to call it like a witch show or something and i i just see him stepping down and also he has health issues so i Mm -hmm. feel he'll use that as an excuse i'm still getting stuff with thomas where he's, he's going to step down oh i think he's the first one to go and I don't, and I've I've been saying this for two years now. I thought it would be right around the election. Good, good. Or maybe it's and, right when he realizes that Trump is not going to get in. He may decide, okay, I'm out of here. Well, he doesn't. He does it for the wife mostly. Oh yeah, because well, he knows really, that they're going to be diving in. He hasn't recused himself on anything, and now it's all coming up. With all that she did, he better recuse himself. Right. Right. Somebody said, would you please choose to answer questions which you have not already answered many times and pick new ones? I guess she's my new agent. Well, to be honest with you, I don't remember what I've seen. Not only that, but a lot of times people haven't watched all the shows. And so the yeah, question is coming the same up. Thing. So sometimes I do repeat myself. If it bothers you too much, you're welcome not to watch the show. Well, I got I got reprimanded by one person that wrote in and said, that it was insulting that I remind people to vote all the time because if they're going to watch your channel, I'm like, okay, delete. (laughs) 
you know, you know and she, again, she found, she found it insulting. I'm like, don't watch my show. That's not insulting, no. No, it's just trying to remind people because not everybody has watched the shows all the time. This could be a first person coming to the show. Right, right. I was yeah. just telling the client I read earlier, I'm going to talk more about how to manifest like I used to in the beginning. But what happened is I remember talking about that, but a lot of people are new to my right. arena, so I want to help them. Oh, okay. Uh, did you ever read this? Uh, Pam said, will there be any criminal charges against Stephen Miller? Yes. Oh, good. good. I've always felt that he's a guy responsible for like, you know, separating families. Yeah, there's something with the children, I think. He's a little yeah. Nazi. It's very ugly. I it? always see him in a Nazi uniform. Always. Him yeah. and uh, Jared Kushner. Just up his SS. Right. I always see it. So Peggy said, have you heard anything about a great flash of light that will cause a change in the energy of the world? Interesting she asked that because before I got on with you, they were just talking about a, what do you call those things from the sun? Solar flare? That hit Dublin, Ireland, and it mm. blew out their airport. Wow. Not, you know, they were able to bring it back up, but mm -hmm. it changed things. So that's interesting. Uh, th the energy of the world won't get changed by a hit of energy. That's already taking place. It's Some already of you are noticing by being tired, ringing in the ears. Yeah. I was talking about that, too, about ringing in the ears and just, like, wanting to fall asleep. And I say, give in to it unless you're driving. Yeah. Margaret says, I have a feeling that Trump will suffer one humiliation after the other until after the election. Your words to God's ears. Absolutely, girlfriend. It's so funny because as soon as that alleged attempt, he was on trying to sell. That's what I said. I feel I have a file fire. ready for all this stuff to go. You know, and the other thing about the dogs and the cats and all that kind of stuff. Wasn't Robert Kennedy Jr. that was supposedly accused of eating dog? Yes. So why aren't they bringing that up? He eats vermin off the, the that gets Road, hit. Roadkill. Yeah. yeah, I don't. I it's that, and then also they admitted that they made it up. Oh well, the woman that on Facebook is now fearing that her kid, her daughter is going to be like, we're going after her daughter. Yeah. Jesus, Meow just said, our mail in Southern Maine has no carrier. We have to pick up at the P.O. box office. Wow. I'm so sorry. I feel that'll be improved. But listen, I found out something. What? So Biden chose two new people to take over in the, but they haven't been approved yet. Right. And but once by they are, can vote out. But by who? Who hasn't approved them? The Senate? The Congress? Who hasn't approved them? Congress. Damn. Well, of course. And so they'll get approved the minute they get him out. And once they get in, then they can ask Joy. They have to vote him well, out. Uh, this is one I repeat, but I want people to, to be okay. Will Putin try to use nukes? No. Let me no. tell you why. More so, not that he doesn't have nukes. He doesn't have the staff or the money to play that game. They will wipe him out in a breath. He does not have the staff or the money. But if there's rumors of him trying or if he's going to tell people we're going to just die as a country because I'm going to wipe them out, they'll take him out before that he can do that. Mm -hmm. That's what I've always seen. I always see there's he goes away, you know, it's, and not by his own volition. So J Junko said... Uh, is Deborah Powell, Debbie Powell, going to take down Jim Jordan? A new poll from Florida Atlantic University shows Rick Scott with only a three-point lead. Did you ever get on that? I've always felt Rick, it's very tied tied with Rick Scott, but he's still going around talking about you know after birth abortions, crushing babies' heads, turning women stuff. off. Yeah, yeah. Will Debbie win? Is he a senator or is he a Who? I'm feeling 
It's going to be close, but there's a possibility that she does. Well, Debbie Wynn, yes or no? Just give me the answer. Yes. We come in peace. She's working hard. Look, she's handed the job. She's handed the job. Looks real good, you guys. Um, And she's got more love to her. She comes off in a more caring way about the United States. Ten of Cups and the hopes, dreams, and wishes. Yeah, you can't get better than that. Celebration, two of Cups. And the outcome card is the chariot. She gets on the horse and she and it goes fast. And the cycle changes. She'll be involved with a lot of changes. Good. He looks like that guy from Poltergeist, that man with the hat, that weird. Oh, the, pre- the, the preacher? That guy was scary looking. Yeah. Oh, did you have a question? No. Just don't no. ask me my weight. No, I'm good. Uh, what are the most lot of numbers? No, I'm just kidding. Actually, I get people asking me for a lot of numbers. I'm like, sweetheart, those numbers are mine. But if I could do that, I'd be in Bahama, BG. Oh, I know. Or you know by now. Edgar Casey found out. He tried to help people find oil and stuff. And he was always failing, especially for himself. Because, he, you know, he would sleep and he'd ask the higher realm and he'd get stuff. But it never worked out. And it's almost like they won't let you. Profit. Now, I don't know if this story is true or not, but somebody did, did some research on him was telling me that at one point he was looking around the house and they had like a new table, they had new dishes, new stuff was in the house. And he said, well, where is this coming from? And then he found out that supposedly his wife and her brother were asking what horses were going to win while he was sleeping. Oh and when he God. found out, he freaked out. They're going to take it away from us. Yeah, yeah. I don't know. His wife was a little bit of a stickler with being. But I'm just like, saying that that's, I just said it's a story. It's a good story. Yeah. But I don't know. But people don't realize that. I mean, I have had a couple of reader friends that one of them was doing really well. And then he started telling people what they wanted to hear. And That's hard. Yeah. I said, you can't be doing that. He was doing it for the money and not for helping people. And I said, if you don't stop, they're going to take it away from you. And four months later, he calls me and said, I look at cards. <clears throat> it doesn't mean anything to me anymore. I can't read. Yeah. I said, You're going to have to humble yourself. That happens. I When I first started reading years ago, I read a lot of famous people and stuff. And I wanted to please them. So, so sometimes I think I mm-hmm. sort of gave them what they wanted to hear. And I, my abilities weren't as strong, for sure. Right. You have and, to just tell the truth. But it took about six months, but then he turned it around. They gave him, they gave him his gift back. But he had a, he, 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 like, he bought this really, really expensive car. And so we went and turned it back in and all this other stuff, you know. And, yeah, because uh, he was living high on the hog. Mm-hmm. There's people that read like stockbrokers and stuff like that. I wouldn't want that kind of pressure. I read for this. I was doing this one group with a group of Sikhs up in uh, Mount Shasta years ago. And this guy stood up and said, he's really good. He saved me a million dollars in the stock market. This is back in like 2008 when everything was going crazy. I don't know anything about stock markets. I Me neither. I, I don't have any money in stock. But I read a little old lady years ago who had several million and she she was like 80 something. And I she said, should I keep my money in that stock? What are you seeing? And I just looked and I said, ah, take it out. It's going to crash. And it did. Right. Well, that's what I was doing with him. And so he stood up and said, everybody, he saved me millions of dollars and he's really good. And so then he came up to me afterward and said, so what do you think? I said, I saved you millions of dollars. Where's my car? Where's my candy? Where's my flowers? Okay. Number one. Number two, this was the kicker. You never paid for that reading yet. Oh, my God. So hey, that'll top, hit him. Karma will come back on him. Well, what he did was he, he's him and his wife were very cheap. So um, he wrote me a check for like, I think like a hundred dollars or something. He goes here. I've never heard from him since. And it was like, okay, fine. Good luck. Yeah. But no, it's, you know, it's, 
we can't use it for ourselves. I mean, that's why the college kids always need shoes. I mean, and Jean used to say, you know, you cannot do this for yourself. We can't. I can't read myself. No. I will have prophetic dreams, though. Yeah. Well, there's, I can't read there's a difference between reading for yourself, wanting to know something, or them telling you something, beware of this, beware of that, don't go down that, you know. And whatever. sometimes I know I'm so pretty powerful. I, I would want the cards to say something that what I wanted mean? to hear. I mean, I always read you. Hey, girl, you look really nice today. I'll read you anytime. <laughs> hey, listen, um, uh, Genevieve said, some political pundits say Kamala will win the popular vote. But Trump has a path to win the electoral vote. No, I don't get it. I and was don't watch these these pro pro professionals. Just turn that TV off. I'm going to tell you. I'll go on the limb. I kept on feeling her around 281. I think she's higher than that in electoral college. She's going to win North Carolina. She's going to win Florida. If she wins Florida too, which is very likely, she'll be up just like my favorite guy David Feldman says. In the 300s. Yeah, let's hope so. So, um, but you still win. I mean, the thing is, we have to make it happen, but don't freak out. Even when Trump was up in the polls, we were saying, don't look at the polls. Even yeah. though she's up in the polls, oh, people don't look at the worried. polls. Yeah. And you don't think those, those people on the news did love sticking us with fear like that? Well, that's clickbait. That's how they make their money. That's how the advertising. Oh, we got all these people watching the show tonight. We can, you know, charge more for advertising. It's yeah. it's all about money. It's all about greed. Yeah. Well, it's not going to happen. I, you know, I I don't want you to rest on your laurels. I still need you to vote, yeah. but I don't want you to worry. Remember last time I said I saw people dancing in the streets, and I get the same thing now. I see people blowing horns and going crazy. But I don't think it's going to be a long, as long as it was with Biden to find out the winner. I think it will be much sooner, either that night or the next day. It's going to be, people ask me, will it be a landslide? I'm just, or, or what the number's going to be? They're enough that they don't have to question them. That's what I read. Yeah, like he's not going to be able to play that. It was cheating. But he'll still call it cheating. Oh, he's, still, he's, already, he's already set the table for that. Yeah. Is Laura Lomer a QAnon follower? I don't even know what QAnon is. QAnon, you know, the, the crazy people. Um, I Entertainment purposes only. I think she's on somebody's payroll. And getting, paid in, and getting paid in rubles. Okay. She's scary looking. I uh, I saw her when she was younger and she does look female, but I couldn't tell if she was a man. She's got like this weird face. Her body is fine, but her face looked like a scary face. That would scare me to death. Like a monster face. Gargoyle. I wanted one day to come on the show and I still may do it. Those eyebrows, they're like the eyebrows that uh, the Satan's wife had. I wanted to get something and just put the thick old ass eyebrows. And what was the other thing I was going to do? I can't remember, but I knew I wanted, oh, eyeliner like J.D. Vance. I wanted to do a video. Oh, my God. Actually, I was working on a meme. It didn't work out, but I was trying to do a dra Trump as a drag queen and call it misinformation. <laughs> so, um. I know we've answered this. I do see Alito having to come off the bench. I do see yeah. hearings with the Senate, but I don't see it happening beforehand. What about you? No, I, I feel Thomas may step down before or right around the elections, but all the other stuff, the hearings and all that, that's when the new administration comes in. Yeah. And they, they're just going to say, we got some explaining to do. Also, you don't have to, uh, uh, you know, McConnell kept that you have to have so much to do it, and then he changed it just to fifty to fifty one to to walk and, everybody uh, in to walk. Uh, yeah, so that's what they're going to do. They're going to say yeah. next, next. I actually feel they may get rid of the filibuster. They did. He did. No, I'm saying I feel that the the new Congress will get rid of the filibuster. Okay. okay. So that way they don't have to play around with. We have to have 68 or six, whatever it is, you know, to come in. It's right. like that way 
Harris gets what and Walls what they're working on gets through. Like somebody asked about student loans, I still feel yeah that's going to get through. It's just that every time Biden did it, one of the Trump judges, you know, pulled it down. Yeah, yeah. So, um, Adam Kissinger, mm -hmm. will he be offered a position? I wasn't feeling yes. I'm not sure. I know Liz will. Well, we know George Santos will not. So, um, I'm not sure. I'm right. not sure. And Priscilla said were Kamala's earrings she wore at the debate earpieces. No, they were not. That she was Laura, earrings, that was Laura Lumen that started that. Oh, she, of course. They already had. She wore those at some event like a year ago, and they had pictures of her with those on. So that that was that's total fake, right? We have to be careful. These people just lie, lie, lie. It's really well, like Trump saying she, she she did so well. She must have had the questions beforehand. It's like, oh, you're admitting she did well. <laughs> now listen, you guys. You need to just breathe. And in your and try you can as best as you can to be in the now, and don't worry. Just hand it over and just thank the universe and say, "I know peace will come." And and then after this is over, we'll still have pray praise. Oh God, yes. We're gonna still have some stuff, and we'll talk more about it as we get closer. But, but just we still now. have to be humble. We still have to be grateful for all that we have—the good, the bad, and the ugly—because. Yeah. All the stuff with Trump, we in some ways we will be grateful for when it's all over because it got us to where we're supposed to be. Yeah. Yeah. And then we have to work as brethren together for all these uh, earth changes that are taking place. Oh god. We don't have time for this riff rap. Yeah. So it's there's but the shift has already started. You know it's already here, yeah. They it started. When did it start? I would say that? I kept on feeling it after the eclipse in uh, April. I just started feeling really tired and I was dizzy. Yeah. Well, that's that's how you were before, though. Uh, <laughs> okay, it's a good excuse. Give this me some ship. space, Benvolio, or I shall faint. Yeah, it's yeah. when you start wearing a tinfoil hat. <laughs> so, did you watch the Emmys last night? No. I have to watch Shogun. I heard it's all, you got to read it. Sometimes, oh, subtitle? But I want everything. I love subtitle movies because that way it gets me out of my head and I have to read. Yeah. And the no. other one that kept winning was. Um, Bear? Bear won a lot. But my yeah. sister says, I don't understand how it's a comedy. I've never watched it. I don't know. And the other one won, that won is. That's Jeep a Gene Wilder's grandson. Huh? The guy, the guy that stars in Bear is Gene Wilder's grandson. No kidding. Yeah. But what about um, with the hair? Yeah, the guy was also in Shameless. Okay. Now, what about uh, the other one? Is it's called it Gene? Um, Hack. No, not Pack. No, Hack with Gene Smart. No. Yes, Hack. Sorry. Have you watched that? Yeah. It's Is it good. good? Yeah. I have it's to watch great. it. You know, I never watched the, the, the guys from Canada that were the MCs. They did a show everybody loved. Um, I can't think of the name of it. I never watched it, but I heard it was fantastic. I have a hard time watching series. I, I have a short attention span. I wait till they all the series, then I just sit and binge watch, you know. Yeah. I, I, you know, I, I will do Shogun and Hack. Mm -hmm. I love Severance, that show Severance on Apple TV. I haven't seen First it. season, the second season should be coming out soon. Even uh, Joe on MSNBC said, Have you guys watched that? That's a good show. It's very different, very different. I like that. A little avant garde. So, okay, my friend. Well, happy Monday to you. And you too, my dear. Thank and uh, <sighs> we're all in this together. We're on all this together. And, we're, and you know, uh, we heard, no I heard from Mal. Alone. 
No one Mel's doing that. good. He's in Switzerland. Okay. And I don't know when he's coming back. I don't think he wants to come back. Well, you know, when he calls and says, hey, Linda, I'll say, who's this? But anyway. Uh, Do I know you? But thank you for stepping in for him today. Anytime. Thank you for allowing me to and asking. All and right. how's your calendar doing? Do you have any openings in October? All of October is open. Okay. So if anybody needs anything. I've heard people have come back to me and said, oh, Linda, he's good. Tell me who they are so I think I'm a free reading next time. Okay. <laughs> okay. All right, sweetie. Thanks, everyone. Thank Thanks, you. Thanks, everyone. We'll catch you later. Cheers. Mm -hmm.